Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food adventure just for you. I'm in the overcast cold city of Barrie, Ontario, Canada at Taco Bell to try this limited edition triple double crunch wrap. As a lot of you guys know, one of my favorite things here at Taco Bell is the Crunch Wrap Supreme. Uh, I order that pretty much anytime I come here, unless I'm making a new video for with you guys. And it looks awesome, and it says you can actually make it spicy. So we're gonna do the spicy triple double, I wanna call it the triple down. The triple double Crunch Wrap is three delicious layers all wrapped up and ready to eat, double stuffed with two layers of seasoned beef, cheesy goodness, and crunchy tostadas, and top off with shredded lettuce, tomatoes, and sour cream. It's goodness on repeat. Let's order. All right, guys, we're up next. I like to order the uh, triple double crunch wrap with the Mountain Dew, uh, Baja Blast and sure. fries and the, the box? instead of the uh, if if I did the box instead of the instead of the twist can I do this the Cinnabon? Sure, yeah. Okay, good. That's cool. I just don't like the cinnamon twist, so. Sure. So you want spicy or regular? Oh, spicy, box? spicy. Thanks for asking. And with a soft taco or a hard shell taco? Soft, please. And with the regular fries or fries of meat? Uh, this is regular fries. What's your drink with that? Uh, the Baja Blast Mountain Dew. Okay, and uh, you want substitute cinnamon twist before that cinnamon light, right? Please. Okay, anything else? That's it, thank you. Okay, your total is 13 dollars Alright, thanks. Alright, 13 I, That's way cheaper than I thought it was going to be, actually. That's cool that they'll switch out those cinnamon twists, because I don't like those cinnamon twists. They, they stick to the roof of my mouth. <laughs> Sorry, Taco Bell. One cool upgrade that we're using today is the media mod that goes around my GoPro. So let me hit a little quick recording. So we're doing a little bit of a test to see uh, if the wind will affect it with this new thing on there. So that is my media mod. I always hang my GoPro upside down with a suction cup. A little behind the scenes action for you guys. So the media mod is this case that goes all the way around uh, and so the GoPro actually sits inside the media mod and then they have a new microphone that you put on here with this little dead cat kind of thing and that's uh, supposed to give us better audio and also protect a little bit of the wind which is one of the biggest things I find when I'm doing these drive throughs and the windows open and it just goes across my uh, my microphone there so I'm hoping that fixes it let me know in the comments below if you like the audio in this particular video compared to the last video where I didn't use the media mod I this is the first time we're using the media mod uh, some of the times in the summertime I have like two windows open and the wind is like rush, rushing through and uh, either I use a different mic or I have to have the windows closed and then it gets too hot in the car so uh, let's get some feedback from you guys thank you fantastic thank you Yes, thank you. Have a good day. All right, people. Let's park it. All right, guys, we are parked. Let's get out the trusty steering wheel tray and start eating, shall we? Oh, my goodness. I am so looking forward to this. Did they actually make the Crunch Wrap Supreme taste even better? I don't know. We'll find out. And uh, you kind of talked me into the box. It wasn't wanting to eat that much, but uh, hey, I'm easily persuade. And as long as they could switch out those cinnamon bun, cinnamon twist things. Oh, interesting, look at that. The knife and fork and all that stuff is stuck to the top. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be stuck to the top. One of those things, you know? All the napkins are in here too. We got napkins, got the triple double and my cinnamon things. So uh, we're gonna have to empty the box and uh, let's just do it one at a time here. There's that. That's interesting. There's What is that then? That must be the cinnamon twist. Oh, this is the cinnamon little uh, round things, the donut things. This would be the soft taco. Then what is this? This would be, this is the, the triple double. And I, oh, that's the french fries. All right. We got it. I'm gonna set it all up, going for a close up. All right. 
right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are going in for the extreme close-up of this amazing lunch here at Taco Bell. Over here we got our Baja Blast. Check that out. It was dribbling down the side like that. I had to give it a little wipe before I put it in my drink holder. Over here we got those golden french fries. Over here we got our cinnamon bites. Here is our soft taco. I prefer soft taco over hard taco. Let me know in the comments below. Do you prefer it soft or do you prefer it hard? Ooh la la. I prefer it soft. And over here, ladies and gentlemen, is our triple double crunch wrap. Can't wait to try that and see if it's better than the crunch wrap supreme. I'm hoping so. That'd be great. Let's eat. First up, let's get a quick sip. Mountain Dew. Baja. Blast! Sorry, I didn't mean to yell. Yes, I did. Okay. French fries. Look how many French fries. This is, uh, again, a Taco Bell KFC combination location. And so they do fries. The fries are not Oh, please don't hit my car. Please don't hit my car. Whoa. That was so close. Dude. Where is he going? Like there's no space for him to go that way. He <laughs> better not be going through the drive-thru. What if he thought it was an exit? Hmm. The fries are not particularly warm. They're very lukewarm. So, we'll put them over there for now. But I want to get into the soft taco. Lettuce is falling out like usual. That's all right. I'll fold one side so it doesn't, more stuff doesn't fall out. We'll check that out, people. Mm-hmm. With all that Taco Bell goodness, seasoned ground beef, that crunchy lettuce, and that cheese. I forgot to ask for sauce. No big deal. You gotta get the lettuce in whenever you can. Oh, this is like a bad spot to park. I'm in an actual parking spot, but it's right on this really tight corner. Now that's two trucks that have gone in there. And there's no way that pure lighter truck. Okay, he's turning. <laughs> it's, just, it's chaos here. It's like a nice little appetizer, but for going, before you get into the main course, the ground beef is phenomenal. So is the chicken, but I think I prefer the ground beef sometimes. Good stuff. Pure later guy is uh, delivering some signs or something. Okay, there is your triple double crunch wrap all nicely folded in, nicely toasted. Let's go in for that awesome first bite of this Taco Bell goodness. Cheers. Mmm, still warm. We can open it up a bit, maybe. Nope. <laughs> I haven't started getting the uh, spicy part yet. You'd think it'd be part of the um, the meat mixture. It's pretty good. I'm thinking the Crunchwrap Supreme just has more vegetables in it, and it's just a bit bigger. 
uh, like thickness wise. I'm guessing it's been a while to, so I have to watch an old video or something. But all the flavors there, the just the overall experience. Okay. The uh, the spiciness is starting to come through. Hmm. Whenever I eat at places like this, I always have to order the spicy. It's just it's just so much better. I also have some amazing news for you guys to share with you on this channel. I already shared it uh, on my vlog channel, but I just picked up Rusty, which is my van camper. It's finally fixed. It's finally at 100%. Uh, now I feel super safe. It was all about the back latch uh, not locking, and then they had problems Originally, with when I first bought it, the actual latch uh, hitch part was broken, so they replaced it, but then the, the lock never worked. And uh, when they're doing the lock, they said you have to buy the, the actual automatic lift gate, which is what would be cool to have. And then there was other problems, but anyway, I finally got it fixed. It took forever because the, uh, the lift gate uh, had to be plugged into a module and the module was all corroded and that was one of the main reasons uh, It didn't work plus the lift gate was broken plus the latch was broken I don't know what the people did before I had that vehicle how much damage they did to that back door Maybe it was in an accident. I don't know but uh, now it works 100% so things to look forward to is uh, more 24-hour uh, eating at restaurants uh, stealth camping regular camping and I saw a few people asking if I'm going to be doing stuff in the winter time I am definitely going to be doing stuff in the winter time I've got a heater in there I want to do uh, some other extra things I don't want to tell you yet it's top secret and I uh, just want to get the word out too soon but uh, look forward to that I'm super excited to get Rusty back I haven't had him in my in my driveway for like 10 days uh, because they're waiting on parts to be made because uh, Chrysler doesn't make certain parts anymore so they actually have to get them made manufactured in the United States somewhere so we're all good to go guys on uh, more stealth camping and 24-hour videos cheers thanks for all the support on those by the way mmm do you hear that crunch mm-hmm oh boy I just hit a jalapeno Woo! that Jalapeno was spicy. Hmm. I wasn't expecting that. I don't think it said jalapenos on there. All right, guys, I am loving this so much. I'm going to have to give it a one o'clock in the morning shout out bye to all you amazing men and women out there who love to watch my videos at one o'clock in the morning. We don't know why you do, but you do. This next bite is just for you. Cheers. Mm. Soft tortilla shell. Fantastic. So if you are watching this at one o'clock in the morning and if you are watching this while eating Taco Bell, make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. I'd also love to know where you guys would love to see me go first to do a 24 hour stealth camp or just a regular stealth camp or a camping on crown land type thing. You guys let me know where you wanna go. I'm gonna read all the comments, try to find a common denominator between all your comments and then we'll see if we can do that for you all right start writing i'll keep eating taco shell inside is crunchy still the jalapenos are crunchy and hot the sour cream is definitely helping keep the heat level down from those jalapenos because they are hot Two bites. Again, a big crunch. I like bit into that last second last piece. I 
I thought by now it'd be all soggy inside. It's still crunchy. That's crazy. Crunchy. <laughs> Baja Blast. What's your favorite drink at Taco Bell? Last but not least, the Cinnabon Delights. They are like a donut and inside is the Cinnabon icing. And on the outside looks like they have brown sugar and cinnamon. Or maybe just regular sugar and cinnamon. It looks like brown sugar, but maybe the cinnamon's making it brown. I don't know. Mm hmm. It almost tastes like uh, you're eating uh, cake batter. Somebody's making a birthday cake. And you look around, nobody's around, but the batter is sitting there. And there's the mixing spoon just asking to be licked. It tastes like that. Yummy. I'd also love to hear some feedback from you guys. What is better, the cinnamon twists or the Cinnabon delights? Let's have a discussion in the comment section below. I'm going to start it off by saying the Cinnabon delights are way better than the cinnamon twists. But let's hear your feedback. Mmm. Mmm. Cinnamon twist. <coughs> Ew. Cinnabon delight. Mmm. All right, guys, we are all done. <laughs> Rebound. Two points for Ken. All right, guys, on my rating scale, we're going to have to give Taco Bell's triple double crunch wrap a go out and get it now if you have a taco bell anywhere close to you go out and get the triple double crunch wrap and of course get those cinnabons because they're a delight see what i did there all right guys once again i'd love to thank every single one of you guys for all your support on this channel through subscribing through your commenting through your thumbsing up every single one of my videos, you guys rock. And all my channel members for all your amazing monthly support on this channel. And as always, my patrons over on my Patreon, you guys rock. If you wanna show your support for me doing these videos just for you, hit it with a thumbs up, ding, 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 ding. But if you're still hungry for more, check out that amazing playlist I dumped down over there and we'll see you over there. Bring your hunger.